Hello, my lovely Virgos, and a very warm welcome to your November 2021 horoscope. This is a very powerful month and next month because we're in eclipse seasons. And eclipse seasons are generally intense and often they are our game changers. Everything in your life can be transformed, transmuted during this time. What is it that you want to change? Is it your health, your well-being, your relationships, your finances, your spiritual direction, your career? Things can turn on a dime at this time if you're willing to let go and to investigate and explore new possibilities. It's about opening your mind. So on the fourth of the month, we've got a lovely new moon happening in this third house. And on the sixth of the month, Mercury joining the party in the third house. So the third house has to do with communications and a new beginning with the moon there, new communications, new networks. It's also the house of learning and studying. So you might be learning something new. You might be sharing some new information. It's wonderful for writing. It's wonderful for reaching out to people who may need just a word, just a sign, just something. And you might really save somebody. The third house has to do with tuning into the higher mind, if you can. The lower mind will, will lead you a merry dance. But with Mars there, if you can tune into the highest possible mental thoughts that you've got, what are the highest thoughts you can have for yourself? When I do these videos, I'm always trying to be conscious of what can I send to you that will be good and positive and encouraging energy to you? What can I do? I'm always trying to be cognizant of that so that you get an energy from me. And this is about creating an energy through the words you use and choose, through the thoughts you choose. It's powerful. And it can change your life and the lives of the people around you, far and wide. Also on the sixth, we've got Venus coming into your fifth house. Woohoo! Venus loves to be in the fifth. Venus brings romance in the fifth, if that's what you're looking for. It's very good for your own business. It's very good for launching something. It's good for your creativity. It's good for entertaining. It's good for having fun and enjoyment. And just doing things that are fun. Going to the sea, going in nature, playing with an animal, having a hot bath, getting a massage, whatever it is that you enjoy. Do it with the Venus there and with the Pluto together. This can bring you a very powerful, transformative relationship. And it can also transform the relationship you have with yourself and loving yourself and being deeply compassionate and caring with yourself. And on the 19th of the month, we have the lunar eclipse happening here, resonating with Uranus in your ninth house. So lunar eclipse in the ninth, this is an opportunity here to look at your spiritual world. What will give me more meaning in my life? Often lunar eclipses bring up the opposite of what you want. Yes, it may bring up your discontent, your longing, your wish for something different. What is it you want? How can you go deeper? Maybe you want to travel. Maybe you want to explore new communities, new people. It's time to be brave and also time to let go of what's not been working for you. So that something new and better can come into your world. It's powerful. On the 22nd of the month, the sun is coming into your fourth house, shining a light on your home, your family. It's a wonderful time for doing something with family. It's a wonderful time for um, upgrading anything in your environment, your home. It's about bringing the sunshine in. So how can you make your home lighter? The place that you work in lighter and brighter. So cleaning is great, of course. You could use smells, you could use sage, you could use oils, whatever it is to brighten your atmosphere. 
because that rubs off on you and that in turn rubs off on others. So make it as positive and uplifting as you can and watch the magic happen. So there you have it, my lovely Virgos. I wish you a wonderful month and I thank you for liking, commenting, sharing and subbing. Bye for now.